So far, I've loved it here. I have been welcomed with open arms here. I really have been getting to know the staff right now, and that's what my main focus has been while I've been here, is I want to get to know them as educators and as individuals as well. So I know that for many of the staff members, visibility and accessibility is important to them. So that has been my main goal while I've been here, and the staff has been appreciative of my efforts, and I really feel like it's exactly what I want to do. I worked in the East Brunswick School District for 20 years. I started as a seventh grade special ed teacher. I moved on to being a first grade teacher, and then I was a reading specialist, and lastly I was an instructional coach. And all of those roles have helped me in this current position. I would say the last one as being the instructional coach really helped me a lot because I got to work on content with teachers, I got to work on their planning with them, looking at the school's goals and the district's goals and trying to help the teachers align their own classroom goals with it. I think by coming here, I'm hoping to do those same sort of things, but as well I'm learning about the parts of the job that I didn't have an opportunity to do. So there, there are a lot of other moving parts to this job that I'm, I'm learning about. The one thing that I've heard from teachers is that they're really happy that I was in a district for so long and that I wasn't an administrator yet. So they said it's nice to have somebody who's had all that experience in the classroom because they really the think that I understand the what they're going through in the classroom. My main personal goal is building the relationships with the staff. So that would be my ultimate goal for this year. I think that until I have the relationship with the staff members, I am not going to be able to accomplish everything that I want to accomplish in, in my role. I think also I need to see within the district where I can bring my expertise in and help to better the district as well. So I would say that those are, are like two important goals, goals for me. Goals, but isn't that kind of what you have? Most people have heard of this district. It's very well known that it has such a great reputation. But what also attracted me to the district and more important to me is that the goals of this district are in line in alignment with my beliefs, which are to look at the whole child, to really focus on those social and emotional needs, which we know are so important in middle school. I'm putting myself out there again. I have to rebuild my reputation in a new place, and I need to learn everything now. So where I came from, I was there for 20 years, so I felt I was the one people were coming to with all their questions and I had all the answers to everything. And now I'm the one with all the questions and asking for answers and trying to find things out. So I just want to make sure that I'm doing everything that needs to be done and, and living up to people's expectations and what, what they need from me, I'm giving them. We could do this as coming to West Windsor Plainsboro School District, being able to work with my principal, Lamont Thomas, and the assistant principal, Jack Colella. They really are giving me some good insight into what things administrators do. And really, with on every day, there are different situations that I'm learning from. So I feel like that is just going to help me grow as an administrator. The security drills and crisis drills, I'm learning a lot on a daily basis. So all of this is are things to be excited about for me just because it's helping me grow as an administrator, which is what I want to do. People feel comfortable talking to me and getting to know me. I think outside of the box and want to try different things. I'm not somebody who will just give up on something. I want to keep going until we can figure out how we can do something the way that people want it done. Because of my vast experience in the past 20 years in my previous school district and with my personal beliefs and my family, I feel like having both of those experiences are definitely going to help me in my new role in the West Windsor Plainsboro School District.
Prior to West Windsor Plainsboro, I worked for Lawrence Township Public Schools. Uh, I was the high school assistant principal at Lawrence High School. I was there for five years. And prior to New Jersey, I worked as a high school administrator in Illinois. I am from Illinois. And prior to administration, I taught music. I've taught all levels of music, concentrating in middle school and high school band and choir. I was fortunate enough to spend some time teaching overseas in both Paraguay and Bolivia at American International Schools. Hi, I'm Jessica Sincata, the assistant principal at High School North, and I'm calling to check in on Lewis. Yes, we have a Correct, correct. Hi, nice to Goals meet you. Goals coming into high school north. First and foremost, I need to create relationships. I need to create relationships with students, with new staff and faculty, and with parents. That means I need to have a lot of face time with our kids. I need to make sure that I'm visible for our staff and faculty so that they know that I, they can approach me with questions, problems, um, and hopefully solutions to problems as we go throughout the year, as well as taking time to meet with families um, that might be with other staff members and on my own. Thank you. When looking for positions, I was attracted to West Windsor Plainsboro, not only because of the long history of academic excellence, but when I really dug into the website and took a look at the strategic plan that we are beginning those action steps on this year, I was impressed with the emphasis on total child and a global citizen. Upon leaving High School North in the evenings, I'm headed home to Hopewell Borough, where on the way I would pick up my three and a half year old from daycare and usually head to a high school soccer game to watch my stepson play. My weekends are usually spent on the sidelines of a soccer field, planning a play date, or just playing in the yard with the neighbor boys. In the mornings before school, I try to get a run in with my neighbor, two to three times a week, four when I'm lucky. And my family enjoys travel as much as possible. We will also be traveling to Gettysburg, PA, to visit the oldest at college where she is a freshman this year. Since my arrival at North, the students have welcomed me with open arms. The staff has been incredibly supportive as they help me learn names, departments, classrooms, just around the building, getting to know our families, getting to know how we do things at High School North. I look forward to the year ahead of us. I look forward to working with my administrative team here, with Dr. Dauber and with Mr. James, to enact our strategic plan and move High School North to the next level. <laughs>